New Jersey is number one in the United States in terms of population density, packing approximately 8,882,190 residents into a state with an area of just 8,722.58 square miles. The 11th most populous state in the union and the fourth smallest state, the Garden State's population boom has a lot to do with its proximity to New York City and its placement within the greater New York metro area. However, New Jersey is a fine state all to itself. While the capital of New Jersey is Trenton, it doesn't rank in the top 10 in population within the state of New Jersey. The most populous city in the state is Newark with 282,011 residents. That's good for just the 73rd largest city in the nation, but New Jersey is all about a multitude of towns with heavy population densities. A key reason for New Jersey's massive population is its standing as a pivot point for the greater manufacturing industry in North America. Dubbed the Crossroads of the East, New Jersey is home to thousands of manufacturers which ship goods all over the world. Its biggest export is chemicals, but New Jersey is also known for manufacturing pharmaceuticals, apparel, electronics, electrical goods, machinery, and musical instruments. In addition to its impressive manufacturing sector, New Jersey is known the world over for its research centers. Some of the most important pharmaceutical and chemical tests in the nation take place in the Garden State, and there's a host of other research facilities conducting experiments for a wide swath of different industries and philanthropic aims. If you're thinking of New Jersey as an outsider, farmland is probably not the first thing that pops up in your mind. But perhaps it should be. About one-sixth of New Jersey's land mass is covered by farmland currently in use. That's 790,000 acres worth of farmland in a state that's under 5 million acres in size. New Jersey is a key producer and distributor of many different foods, including dairy products, seafood, poultry, peaches, blueberries, cranberries, carrots, and a host of other vegetables. While manufacturing and agriculture have huge financial implications for the Garden State, Tourism is actually the second most profitable industry in the state behind general manufacturing. With 127 miles of coastline to its credit, New Jersey is home to a litany of different resorts which each offer something intriguing and different. There's also the legal gambling industry in New Jersey after a 1977 ruling opened the doors for casinos to come to Atlantic City. Those casinos are a huge money maker and also a huge employer of New Jersey residents. Casinos and resorts aren't the only tourist attractions worth checking out in the Garden State though. There are many other points of interest you should circle on your to-do list, including the Edison National Historical Site in West Orange, the world-famous Princeton University, Liberty State Park, the New Jersey State Aquarium in Camden, Jersey City, and the Delaware Water Gap. These sites draw tourists in from all over the Northeast and all over the world. Speaking of the world, New Jersey is home to immigrants from five other continents who have brought an amazing and varied culinary culture to the Garden State. One thing that helps all this is the supply of fresh seafood constantly distributed to restaurants from off the Jersey shoreline. There are a litany of different seafood restaurants in New Jersey well worth your time and your money. That's not all for New Jersey food culture though. The Garden State is home to some very unique culinary contributions such as a sloppy joe, the thin crust Trenton tomato pie, Jersey style hot dogs, beef steak, and the pork roll. An intriguing mixture of European influence, New York style, and a host of other cultural contributions, New Jersey is a dream for the adventurous foodie in your family. Are you a sports fan planning on moving to New Jersey? National Football League's New York Giants and New York Jets share MetLife Stadium in East Rutherford. There's also a handful of other professional sports teams, semi-professional squads, and collegiate teams as well. What really makes things interesting for a sports fan residing in New Jersey is New Jersey Turnpike, which serves as one of the primary thoroughfares for automobile travel in the Northeast. If you want to catch a New York Yankees game in New York City or even catch a connector down to Boston to watch the Celtics play, New Jersey is connected to the rest of the Northeast by the Turnpike and other adjacent highways and byways. There is one thing to note when having your car or truck shipped to your place in New Jersey. Be wary of the double-decked George Washington Bridge between the hours of 3 p.m. and 7 p.m. Connecting New Jersey and New York, the Washington Bridge is the heaviest traffic bridge in the entire world. While it has 14 lanes, it can still get backed up something fierce during rush hour. One last thing about driving in New Jersey, don't try to pump your own gas. New Jersey is the only state in the union with required full service gas stations, although Oregon does the same in a more limited capacity. If you plan on raising a family in New Jersey, you'll be happy to know that the public school system is one of the most well-funded systems in the entire nation. New Jersey ranks in the top five in the United States in dollars spent per public school student 
with half of those funds directed towards paying teachers and tutors. So it's also a great state to move to if you're a public school teacher looking for work. And just to sell you on the public school system in New Jersey even more, it was ranked best in the nation back in 2014 by the folks over at Wallet Hub. Add in two of the most prestigious higher education institutions in the nation in Princeton University and Rutgers University, a host of other universities and small colleges, and some great trade schools. And you can see why the Garden State is often lauded as one of the best states to get an education. Once Nexus Auto Transport ships your car, truck, or van to your new home in New Jersey, you'll be able to bypass crowded public transportation and drive to some of the coolest spots in the entire nation. Whether you want to go to a Jets game in East Rutherford or head out to play some blackjack in Atlantic City, the arrival of your vehicle is your key to everything New Jersey and the entire Northeastern United States has to offer.